The Henry Show. Showtime. Henry Hugglemonster and his monster friends were all set to watch Summer's new musical. The curtains opened and Summer danced onto the stage, dressed as a mermaid. Her performance was rawsome, and Henry gave his sister a giant huggle hug when it was over. It looks like so much fun being on stage with all the costume and lights and music, Henry told her, and all that applause. Henry decided he would put on a show, too. Summer offered to help, but Henry wanted to do it all by himself. Henry asked his friends, Denzel and Gertie, to be in the show. What's it called? Denzel asked. It's called, er, uh, Wizard Mountain, Henry said, improvising. It's about a group of brave explorers who climb a mountain and meet a magical wizard. And then they sing a roaring good song and decide to live on the mountain forever. I like it, Gertie said. Where's the mountain? Henry rushed home and grabbed a cardboard box from his room. Gertie and Denzel weren't sure it would work, and they knew it wouldn't when it blew away in the wind. Next, it was time to teach Gertie and Denzel the roaring song. Henry banged on the drums and made it up on the spot, but the song didn't sound very rawsome. This is harder than I thought, Henry said to himself, but I'm sure we'll figure it out, because Huggle Monsters always find a way. Of course, it would have been a lot easier to find a way if Denzel wasn't practicing backflips on the stage and Gertie wasn't making up her own songs on the keyboard. Henry soon realised he needed help. Luckily, he knew the perfect monster to ask, Summer. Summer helped Henry build scenery, make costumes, write a song and invite everyone to the show. At last, it was showtime. Mama, Dado and all of Henry's friends came to watch Wizard Mountain. Henry's performance was monsterific. After the show, he told the audience that he couldn't have done it without Summer and her friends. Rawesome.